why did you put this together or how did this come about? Well, I had some constituents that uh, broached the issue of the neighborhood block and I said, great idea. And so we worked with uh, the residents in the area to help make this uh, a reality. Why is this important? Well, you know, there's a tremendous sense of community in Bayview. And, you know, we had an incident, a sexual assault incident a few weeks ago. And, you know, we have one of the lowest crime rates in the city. We take that type of, you know, uh, you know crime theory seriously. And people want to, you know, you know, get involved. And I think that this walk will help raise the public awareness of personal safety, you know, and measures that they need to take to enhance themselves. The other benefit is the fact that we want to celebrate that we've got a great community here. And you could see from the various people we have here, a tremendous sense of uh, community here and pride in our neighborhood. And this is just one of the many things that, you know, we do in our neighborhood. It's kind of letting people, why a walk? I mean, is it because, you know, these women were mostly walking when, when this happened to them? Is that part of the reason behind it, kind of showing that you can walk through Bayview? Exactly. Okay. That's, precise, sure. that's precisely the point. All right. And I noticed something in the press release that says, you know, you all are going to catch this person. Oh, yeah. Okay. Basically, uh, eyes and ears. If you educate the public and you make them aware of things to look out for, they can play a major role in terms of apprehending criminals. And to the perpetrator of this crime, August 5th, if he's listening to this, you commit any other crimes here, we're going to be looking for you. And you, and so sooner or later, we're going to catch you. And we're not going to stop there. We're not going to stop there. When we go to court, we're going to make sure the judge throws a book at him, too. Have you had a chance to talk to the victim? Like, how is she doing after yeah, all she's, of this? Yeah, I've, I've talked with her uh, a, a number of times. And uh, she's doing you know very well under the circumstances. Anything else you want to say or you think it's important for people to know? No, I just think it's it's important always, you know, be aware of your surroundings and, uh, you know, get to know your neighbors, you know, and just look out for each other. Thank you very much. Oh, you are? So how did you find out about this? On the website. Oh, on the website? Yeah. Okay. On Facebook. On Facebook and yeah. the website. Yeah. Did you get my e-newsletter as well? Yeah, I did. Okay, great. Excellent. Well, just you know, make sure if you uh, if you change your email address, you let me know. Okay. Yeah. Excellent. I got red. I didn't think she was blow up. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> It's so hard. But I have my mom on the left. Why is that? I live on the other side of the Okay, okay. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. I know, right? I feel like we should. Started a little photography club. You are kind of built like a monkey, aren't you? Yeah, this is what happened to the first time. Well, 52,000 in the hotel. You know. And you know it only about 100 You wear it with your dress. It's great. It's great. It's great. Uh, number one, I want everybody to give yourself a great applause and hand. I am told we had over 200 participating in our march here. I know of no other march that shows the strength of our community and our community spirit and how much we care about our community here. I want to.
I want to thank uh, County Supervisor Jason Haas for joining us. We also have our State Senator over here, Chris Larson. Right there. Some very good news as far as an update is concerned. There's been no follow-up uh, sexual assaults in our neighborhood, and I strongly believe, you know, that all the activity that we've had in terms of, you know, our involvement with the police department and the media and so forth has sent a very strong message. If there's, if this criminal is out there, he knows that we're organized and we're looking for him, and we will eventually catch him unless he gets out of our neighborhood here. I want everybody to keep to keep up to speed with what's going on with the night walk here. We have a Facebook page called Bayview Night Walk. Look for Bayview Night Walk, sign up to that Facebook page, and we'll keep you posted, okay? Other than that, have a lot of great food and drinks and have a good time. Thank you. Thank you.